tell you what we're doing now, Gary, and that is, uh, and this is, by the way, for uh, Don Footy Franks and cocktails, available fresh at your nearest supermarket deli. We are about to announce what you've been involved in, all of the Triple M Footy family online, triplem.com.au, now for the best part of a week, mm. and that is the Triple M Team of the Year. Yep. And uh, as we say, it's got nothing to do with form. None. Uh, they, we do like them to be able mm. to do a bit, but... A bit. It's, it's, it's essentially what entertains us as commentators when we go and watch a game. Sometimes they can be real boring glass eye style setup. Yep. As Benny Chu says uh, on the Twitter, Spud, does the glass eye cry when you think of Spud the <laughs> plugger? Does it tears the glass eye? Um, Sit down. But anyway, Lovely. we uh, a little love for you too, Spuddy, off there. But um, banger. Yeah, all bang out, Louie. Uh, so these, uh, a squad of 40 was put together. Jim, yes. you're responsible for a lot of these. Yes. We jump on board and love them. And this is, I would imagine, for some of these players, a couple of retired. Mm. This could be the highlight of their careers, and I'm right. talking their whole careers. No doubt. So there will be some disappointed players. I've also got this too. Oh, the NAB. Yeah, he sealed envelopes. So yeah, the NAB rising one. star yeah. of... Uh, okay. That's right. So you want from the back line, and then you can have... I'll, I'll ask for comment from yes. you, from each of you. In the back pocket. In the back pocket. The rug wearer. Brink wearer. Yep. Is uh, one of our all-time favourites. Yep. Got hey, a man with plastic hair. Plastic hair. <laughs> He's probably yeah. had more talked about his rug than, yeah. than any other player. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah. Yeah. Well, so, uh, he had Hale tried it, and then it came off. Yeah. Mm. So the rug wearer gets in and he will be delighted with that. Source Merritt no, takes full, oh, full back. Yeah. Had to yeah. begin. Wonderful. Jumped a hold of him early, Source. Got the flaming yeah. red hair up there. Yep. And, and he's a uh, triple M boy. He's a weird setup. Yeah, so but he loves yeah. very. He loves the M. And what about this for what about this for a way to go out in the back pocket? Shaken Blake. Oh, yeah, Steve. like it. Oh, like yeah. it. Oh, That's respect. Get shaken on the phone. He'll be teary by now. He will be. It's been emotional. That'll be the only team he's made. Exactly right. <laughs> of representative uh, quality. Shaken Blake yeah. uh, played one of his best games in his last game. Kicked a goal. Yeah. Got his Brownlow votes for the first time last, last year, year. But this will be now Mate, number like one on his CV. No uh, good, good back line. No, half wonderful. back line. Yes. The bearded Melcher. Oh, Melcher. Had to go in. Who's playing tonight. His mum makes good coffee. Yep. He's playing tonight. And what a boost this will give him when the word gets through. Is that right? When you asked for coffee at that shopping centre, yeah. she said, I'm the bearded Melchow's mother. She, she, I think she, she, had, a beard. she had a beard. <laughs> and mate, she kicked the, <laughs> the grand final winning goal last year, yeah. the bearded Melchow. Yeah. So no no, no, Mrs. Mrs. One of the great... Yeah. Yeah. Mrs. Mrs. Melchow didn't have a beard. No. Goosey Maguire. Nah, see, yeah. there's respect too. Well, I tell you what. Now, I don't mind saying this. The Ross Glendinning in the modern era. It was vigorous, vigorous debate about whether Goose got in or not. I no. wasn't sure he should have got in, Gus. No, no, yeah. Put it on the record. On. One of Jim's real early yeah, favourites. He was. He's he was. in out no, of respect. Was. Well yeah. done to Goose. And the other halfback flank just edged out one of his teammates, the sack. Yeah. Sack. Edged out the seed. Another man who loves triple M footy. Yeah. The sack. Tyson Goldstein he could have be, Is he a bit of your swing man as well? He can go half forward. We don't need him in his team, Spud. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bernard on a wing. Ah, there you go. One of the inaugurals. Almost a, yeah. unanimous. Real reptile, yeah. Bernard. The danger in the middle. Danger, danger. Danger. And a man who's in contention for the captaincy of this team. Mm. Dennis. Oh, <laughs> Dennis. Dennis. <laughs> Dennis. <laughs> Dennis. <laughs> He's, yeah, he's on one of your favourite. He's your favourite. Yeah, he is, he is your favourite. And playing tonight, and he'll he'll play a really good defensive half forward role yeah. on the bearded Melcho. You know what will happen? He might go to the bearded Melcho, he will. and the bearded Melcho might say, "Hey, well done on making the triple M." Actually, <laughs> Dennis will go. We yeah, should, thanks, should wait Melcher. till after the game to name the captain. Well, they could be playing at each that's other. A very good point, Spud. I think you need to wait to see if that, that matchup will yeah. transpire. And exactly. I put this to you, Gary, yeah. and that is Dennis is a classic example of someone mm. who was no bloody good at all. No. And then once you jumped onto him, you didn't, and, yeah. and used his first name for comedic value. <laughs> once you did that, and, and the Triple M family got around him, suddenly he played looked back. very good AFL football. Played every game. That's, that's actually it. true, JB. Every so that, single that's game. That's what it can do exactly. to be a Triple M boy. Which is why the NAB Rising Star, yeah. which we're about to announce, mm. is so important. And the beauty about Dennis is when people sort of talk to him, how are you going, Dennis? Mm. They think it's his nickname. No, no, <laughs> it's his real name. Exactly it's right. Dennis. Exactly. He goes, no, I mean, that's my real name, yeah, Dennis. They go, no, oh, okay. He's one of the few in the team who's got his real name as his nickname. That's it. Half forward line of Jeffy. Jeffy. And yep. uh, he's had a good year. He has had a very good year. Uh, bud. Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course yeah, he the goes. Budweiser. Yeah, big Bud. Stevie J. Stevie. Yeah. Now, he was also uh, left out in the original team. Oh, and then no, we he thought put him in. He'll cut up too rough. We knew how rough he'd cut <laughs> exactly. up. Exactly. So that's not about our forward no, line. Very good. This could be the greatest full forward line the world has ever seen. Mm -hmm. I'm going to read them out one after well, the other. On. 
Tip rat, tip rough, push up. Oh, well there, there you are. They just lock themselves in, don't well, they? Can you? I'll, I'll say that again. Say tip again. rat, rough, push up. I think they're the three all timers. As Luke Darcy says, say that again. Do tip rat, rough, push up, Jim. And your Ga- three favourites. And Gary, the playing thing, alongside each the other. The thing about this lot is, uh, like, let me start yeah. with push up. I've been saying it now for a good two years. Don't mess with him, he's connected. <laughs> I've been saying it, Gary. Yeah. And I've asked people to take me seriously. And I think Dinner's now saying, just don't yeah. mess with anyone, push that, up. Don't this bring him inside it. the club. And, and, the, and the thing about Ruff, you talk about using the word disingenuous. This is a man who tries to act as if he's team-orientated. All he cared about was winning the Colman medal this year. <laughs> the only goal. focus he had, and he got there, <laughs> of course. I've seen a man happy to see yeah. Bud Ruff uh, uh, rubbed out. And uh, the Chip Rat Milne, what a phenomenal uh, performer he's been. He's almost carried this team. Single-handedly for uh, a decade. All in contention for the captaincy, yep. along with Dennis mm. and the beard of Melcho. Right. Uh, the ruck is Hair Hat Hale. Yeah, of course. Oh. The big baldy. <laughs> um, <laughs> so the man who fought it. So we've got the he, rug wearer he, and Hair Hat Hale, both he, in the team. Well, he fought it bald for a good five years because mm. his God hasn't handed him a <laughs> magnificent set of cards. No, no, so no. he's got the real early onset bald. Yep. So then he went plastic yep. and it didn't work for him. And I admire the fact that he's gone mm. back. Yeah. <laughs> And I'll tell you what, there's only five, six more places. There are there some disappointed folks out there who have just pulled over Spud and gone, what am I going to get mm, in this yeah. side? Uh, the Ruck Rover is one of the, right, the, one of the stars with a bullet, Daniel Richflavor. Daniel oh. Richflavor. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. Yeah. <laughs> for, the, for the listeners, yeah, Gary have really no idea what a rich oh, flavor no. is. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of people were confused when I first heard it. Mm. I thought there must be a human packet of uh, cigarettes flying out of the That's NCG. It. That's <laughs> it. Well, that is a. Have you explained it, Gaz? Uh, well, these blokes that work, we work with, who yep. smoke a certain cigarette, mm. and they used to be called uh, Peter Jackson Gold. That's it. They're now called. Rich flavor. <laughs> so they go out in the ad break. I oh, know. I have know, a rich yeah. flavor. I'm more worried about our list. Daniel Rich flavor is in. Daniel Rich flavor is in. Yep. And uh, we're happy to have him. A chap. Chap. I don't know. Right. Last night, yeah. if, um, oh, I think last night geez. got him across the line. Yeah. Jim was calling a chap last night, which we played. Pinch star. And then you go to the bench, and ah, oh, gee whiz, Bryce Lett Gibbs is sitting back going, am I going to get in? Spindle Shanks sings him, mm-hmm. I what about Big Cox, yeah. Jack Fitz, 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 yeah. Patrick, yeah, Big Fitz. Texan. Texan's in. On the bench. Nah, you had to get in. The, yeah, yeah, the Tex, Texan yeah, walker. And, and don't worry, he'll be back next year and we'll mm-hmm. dominate Triple M footy. Um, a man who has had issues with his lower back for much of his career. Mm, and yep. uh, we speak, of course, of the porpoise. <laughs> yep. Despite those, <laughs> issues. despite those injuries around the lower the lower back, Lydious. has been able to get himself in. That's we, it. That's a good effort, Jim. Yeah, well, it is. Nasty injury. injuries well, had to play with. Not only a, a, a real bad injury, you yeah. know, that sort of real lower back, yeah. sort of high Coxus buttock. sort of style. High buttock. Mm. But it, it's one of those injuries that won't go away, Gary. No. <laughs> <laughs> Often no. time will heal an injury, no. but with this one for the porpoise, no, it I just, be- he can't shake it. Yeah, and I believe uh, much sympathy for him around Mad Monday this yeah, year, exactly. too. So let's hope he yeah, gets over yeah, it. Mad Mate Sloan, speaking no, of that's I three crows. Know. And he will be very pleased. Oh, he Mad didn't mates. make it last year. No, he didn't. No, because uh, well, he, had a, he won the best and fairest, he which did. helps. Mm. But he we don't did. care so much about that. We'll be in town <laughs> over the next two weeks. He's too. coming to and he's ready. And what about this for a sign of respect for a man that snuck in on the last spot in this team, by the way? Mm. I'm not even sure. There's a lot of people listening right now. Oh, mate, don't you worry, there are. 25 of them, guys. Mm. Jimmy Possum. Possum. Oh. I was waiting for him to come. He snuck in. Because it is going to be a a night game when they play. And as we know with Possum, his eyes, the the whites of his eyes Mm. just expand. And it's just this big... Yeah. Marty Feldman. Jim says like, more hanging out of like than More in out than in. And it's uh, the great caller, and, and I'm talking a great caller, who made a, a, a very frightening career decision to go elsewhere, oh, the, the big briser, Bristol Taylor, used to say, apple in the trap, Gary. We'll get a possum every time. And Jimmy just piles into the trap of a night. So there it is. That will be now be up on the Triple M website. You can have a look at that team. You can agree or disagree, but that's it. Bad luck. Uh, we've got a runner. Speaking of respect, oh. Oh. This, we need a runner. Mm. Yes. Yep. Head Ebert. He goes in the human head. Head is in oh, because no. we just love him. Yep. And the bloke organised the footy trip, Campbell Brown Dog. Oh, <laughs> we need one more. We've got Campbell a pl- Brown Dog. Yeah, we need PR and media manager. Warrior. Wok Fry. <laughs> we need a... Uh, a warrior. We need a, a placebo coach. <laughs> 
I'd be, I'd be quite happy to be well, uh, put me under that. that but no, no, that's no the coach. team. And this is just as important. Oh, that's oh, fantastic. Oh, no. Triple M. com. dot by the way, to look yeah. at that yep. side. I don't know who's won this. This right. is the most prestigious yep. award in media. It's now rising star. I'll go from one up first up to. I'll go from last to first. Yeah, Will the cool. voting panel's votes be uh, aired? <laughs> uh, maybe. I don't know. It's pretty unanimous by the looks of this. Mm, uh, in sixth position, Dane the Ramp Rampy. Yeah, right. yeah. He only came got on, work to do. Came yeah. on late, the yeah. Ramp. He's yeah. got a good head, though. Like yes. Five to Nick Shudo, Echo Graham. Yeah, old Pierre Pierre. Uh, yeah. only played a couple of games, but he got a funny <laughs> yeah. year. Mm. Eight to Rory Brucey Laird. Oh, yeah. Stumpy. Yeah. Hey, that's good voting for him. He didn't come on till mm. late. Eleven, take a look at me. I'm Terry Malera. <laughs> <laughs> Unlucky. <laughs> so... Uh, I should announce the winner because if I announce second, then you'll know who the winner is. Go right. to second. All right. Sam Willie Mays Hayes. Willie Mays Hayes. Who really Ooh. played some nice footy towards the end of yep. the year. And the triple M favourite, Nab Rising Star, nothing to do with the way he played, but more about his name. Jimmy the Tomp Tomper. Oh, oh, the Tomp. Oh, what a, what not what much love for Melbourne this year. What an honour. To have a Nab the the Triple M Rising Star Warrior, that'll make... Uh, Ruzi will be delighted with that. Yeah, he will. Jimmy the, the Tomp 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 Rising Star. He has he, got, he's got something about he, him. He's a grinning man. Once he hears <laughs> yeah. that, he'll oh, be all oh. teeth. The whole family will come oh, over from the South the, Australia the for that. Tomp. I love it. I'm it's a great I'm time. I'm pleased to put my... I'm proud to put yeah, my name on it. That is a great time. Well done to him. Yeah, no doubt about that.